Hello well, girls, how you doing? Let's do another pick a card. And today is going to be how do they feel? That could be triggering, that could be interesting, fascinating, you name it. So let's go, let's stay cool, it's just tarot as I always say. So we do two parts, we develop and then we do a major arcana, okay? So let's go. One, two, one, two. Part number one, how do they feel? Seven of Cups, Page of Wands, Ace of Swords. Well, there's hope. Because a person maybe uh, for a very long time uh, was a bit fake. Oops, I'm shaking everything, sorry. Um, putting things under the carpet, blaming the rest of the world, not taking any responsibility for themselves. Okay, so that's not my kind of people, I have to say. Very immature, okay? So they also may be daydreaming about you, maybe as well a bit, um, how can I say, procrastinating. Uh, they're not really proactive, to be fair, okay? And also maybe they're using that time to actually heal some um, um, deeper issue, and I will hope so, okay? Because <laughs> no guarantee, okay? But anyhow, they're going to an ace of soul now, which is great, because they realize they cannot carry on, uh, and they have to really get to the point where they know what they want and know what they don't want. Maybe as well, life has been a bit harsh, and they probably went through a ten of soul before getting to that ace of soul. So, you know, they know that they cannot procrastinate forever, okay? Things have to change, decision has to be made, maturity has to be gained okay so wow how do they feel they feel like this <laughs> 11 11 so you're really triggering them because normally they would have stayed uh in that you know level of page of ones not taking any responsibility not trying to grow no need for that i can just chill right when they met you there was a big trigger and obviously when you have a twinning kind of uh, energy mirroring each other if you kind of want to have clarity in your life then inevitably they will do the same because they're gonna you know obviously mirror your effort so 11 11 is not for the faint-hearted regardless if you want to name it a uh, twin flame or not it's an idea of intensity here Okay, so being like that, a little bit um, bubbly right there at the surface, it's not going to work. Okay, it's not going to work at all. So there may have been a lot of chemistry between you two, but also a lot of argument because um, someone was not, you know, taking responsibility. And that's enough to really frustrate you. You think so? Indeed. But you didn't buy into their vibe, so they became frustrated as well looking at you, wishing to be with you, but being stuck in that way. Maybe they were stuck with someone else, but also maybe they didn't want to, you know, grow, as simple as that. So at the end of the day, they know from the minute they met you that you had a final destination. It may have been a third party, it's true. It may have been a difference in age, an age gap, a difference in background, religion, education, you name it. It doesn't really matter. Or geographically, they had a distance. Because at the end of the day, you know what I mean? How do they feel? They feel like you are it. Yeah, and you're inspiring them as well. Because you went through a lot of things and you chose to always keep your heart, your heart open. They were kind of like, uh, no, I'm not going there. Where, where were we? I'm not going there because I don't want to grow. But you are the example of someone who had to grow quickly um, and also learn the lesson so you don't redo, uh, repeat the same thing over and over again. So how do they feel? They feel like you are an inspiration. You are final destination. We know that. You teach them how to do things, which is absolutely remarkable. Okay, so uh, let's have a measure. Okay, now I also forgot. Let's have a uh, for part number one, the fool. Yeah, if someone has to take a leap of faith and grow. Otherwise, it will be very foolish. Because when you have that kind of energy in front of you, you have to grab it with both hands. Absolutely. Okay. And even if you're trying to ignore you and put you under the carpet you always come back with a bang you know so what the point okay so how do they feel pal number two page of cups high priestess page of pentacle page 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 huh? so they feel like a little boy little girl really they want to open their heart they want to apologize maybe for their behavior they don't really know how to express emotion uh, you know the end of the movie you see them emotionally uh, naked really and so they cannot hide from you because you know, you can see, you feel, you sense it, you have your antenna switch on 24-7. So what we have here is uh, the someone who they cannot, uh, with whom they cannot pretend. So they have to be real. And what they want to do is actually, let's start again, but this time properly, when I'm going to look after 
the, the golden coin and take care of our relationship i want to invest in, my, in our relationship can i speak today i'm not sure anyhow there is doesn't mean it's always easy it can be a bit conflictual because um when someone feels that they are being seen completely naked they might feel a little bit defensive okay they might want to close the heart fully and they maybe have been like that for a long time and you're opening to them a door of reflection and introspection so they know that there is a different way and they know that you can see the future they can't really see it themselves but you you can do this yeah the empress so you know very well where you stand uh you know that they're coming home inevitably so it depends how long they want to take but you know gonna is inevitable okay so yeah defensive that's what i was going i was telling you absolutely because they cannot see you as clearly they are uh, amazed by you but they cannot read you as easily as you read them by the end of the day it doesn't matter because it become an employee it has to be yeah transformation okay that's it okay Okay, let's have a major arcana here for part number two. How do they feel? Let's see what do we have. We have the strength, yeah, because you've been through a lot yourself. You you've done all that homework. You you've done it, so you are the example of strength, and they know that they want to not compete with you. They want to be inspired by you and join you. Okay, so how do they feel? They feel like uh very strongly <laughs> they feel like they want to commit with you uh, and learn because they don't really know how to do this and that's okay that's all fine okay on this note have a beautiful day and i'll see you tomorrow Mwah. ciao